Hey guys, welcome to another edition of Dan Does Tech Stuff. So today, uh, I will be showing you how to install an app called Chiaki. Now, the reason being is that um, I want to remote play onto my Legion Go device. This also works for the ROG as well. But this is what happens when you connect, say, to your PlayStation uh, for remote play. So you'll, you'll connect and everything will be kind of fine and dandy. But look what happens. You can't control anything. So basically it, it disables the onboard controller. That's your device because it thinks it's a PC and doesn't have like a controller. So the only way to, to make it work, which is, isn't bad, is that you'll need to use your you know PlayStation 5 controller that's like hardwired to make it all work, okay? So that's why this app called Chiaki is what I'll be using today to enable the the actual um, you know controllers for this to work. And this is again this is relevant to the ROG Ally X uh, and the Lenovo Legion Go. So any type of portable PC that does remote. PC access will have this issue, okay? So what you're gonna have to do is um, download an app called Chiaki. So let me get you that website, okay? So I will put this in the description as well. So we'll go to Google and let's see if you can see what I type in here. So you'll type in, it's called GitHub. And the good thing is this is a free, um, app so you don't have to pay but uh be be very thankful that you know there are developers out there who create these things for us to enjoy so much much thanks to those folks who are part of that development team so it's chiaki and then you got to go dash ng forward slash release and i'll have this in the description just in case to make it easier so once you go there, oh, releases. Okay, so once you go here, you're gonna scroll down a little bit to where it will give you some options to download, which is right here, okay? So, Look for the one that says Chiaki Windows 64 VC Portable 1.9.5 zip. So you want to click on that. It's going to go into your downloads folder. So you can see right here, it's going to tell you how much longer it's going to take for it to download. Depending on your internet speed will determine how quickly it will download. And then double click on that it's going to ask you to open up the folder find the app that says Chiaki right here double click it's going to ask you to extract all which will hit extract all hit extract Okay, and then it's gonna just go through the process of downloading. So from start to finish, it probably should take you like less than 10 minutes, give or take. Almost there. Okay, once that opens up, double click. And then you're gonna find you're going to scroll a little bit and find the Chiaki app right here. It's, in, it's going to be in the green. So it's going to be right there. Okay. So double click that. It's going to say Windows protected. You're uh, taking your PC. Um, obviously, I've used this, so I will run it anyway. Okay. Now, again, you want to install this stuff uh, at your own risk. Um, so... That's just a <laughs> that's just a warning, just in case you know if you're not comfortable doing this stuff, hit allow. 
All right. Now in the background, it's gonna say, hey, um, do you wanna set this up for remote play? And you're gonna hit yes. Okay, so A for yes for remote play. All right, so over here, it's gonna say, um, you know, provide that your PlayStation 5 is online, ready to be, um, you know, remote for remote play anyways. Um, go ahead and click into it. Now over here, um, it'll give you a host ID. Okay, so once you have your host ID, um, you're gonna go to public lookup, and then you wanna make sure that the option console is for PS5, okay? So public lookup. Now over here for username, you're gonna use your username that you use for your, your, your PlayStation 5, that's gonna be your gamer tag. So it's not your user to log into your Sony, but it's just your your gamer tag. Here's my keyboard here. Okay, once you put in your gamer tag in there, you'll have the host file, you'll have your PSN ID connected to it. It would have found your gamer tag again, not the one you use to sign in Sony, but your actual gamer tag. And then for the remote play app, this is where you go to your PlayStation and you're gonna go and actually find, go to the remote option on your PlayStation 5. Okay, on your PlayStation 5, you are going to go to your settings. Then you're gonna go over to your system and then you'll go to remote play. So go there to remote play. Click on that. And then it's gonna ask you, what do you wanna do? So you wanna pair the device and it's gonna give you like a four digit code or sorry, an eight digit code. Okay, so once you go to your PlayStation 5, to your settings, systems, remote play, it's gonna give you the remote play pin. So go ahead and click that. So go ahead and put that eight digit code in, okay? Once you put that code in, hit register, and it's gonna run through the console registration. It's gonna do the handshake, and then, voila, it's gonna have your PS5, in my case, my PlayStation 5 Pro. It's gonna say the state it's ready, and I'm gonna go ahead and hit the um, console to connect into it. And there you go. And just like magic, I now have the option to use the controllers from my Legion Go or the RO Ally X. So now that becomes fully operational versus having to, you know, connect a physical controller. So let's let's give this a go. So there are a couple options here on the Chiaki app, okay? So you can go over here to your settings and you have a few settings here. You can add, you can add what do you wanna do when you disconnect, either put your calls back to sleep or do nothing. On the video, you can say, hey, what, what kind of resolution do I want? In this case, let's go with uh, full screen. Uh, you want high quality, which is good. Okay, stream. I, I have it as 1080 here. I'm gonna set the remote play to 1080 as well. Okay, 60 frames per second, that's good. Audio, I kind of leave that alone. Okay, if you, wanna, if you have multiple consoles, you could do that. The controller setup you can configure and that's it so i'm going to go ahead and get into the console i'm going to click on that so there it is it got my console it says it's ready i can click into it and just like magic it tunnels into your system and uh let's go ahead and try my favorite game out um tekken 8 of course 
I'm just going to play maybe like two matches just to see what it's like. Since this is my first time accessing the console using the Chiaki app. So it's pretty phenomenal. I am so excited that there are developers out there that have put in their time and effort to create an app like this for us to enjoy. Alright, let's get in. There's our boy Clive. And let's see how well this plays using the Chiaki app. Now, if you've installed the Chiaki app, let me know how it's going for you. If you find like if there's lag, if there's any delay, um, what are some tips and tricks that you may have, put that in the comment section. Okay. All right, let's play the arcade battle. Medium. All right, let me turn this volume up a little bit. There you go. Our boy King. Let's do like two matches. All right, let's go. Here's my infamous claw style play. Ooh, okay. All right. So I don't really like the D-pad on this Lenovo Legion Go. Much prefer like the actual PlayStation 5 controller or you know on the ROG Ally X controller to this D-pad. It just feels a little stiff to me. It's not terrible. Okay. Maybe I just have to get used to it. Shoulder tackle, and knee, and back kick, back kick again, <laughs> and do the hammer. Alright, we'll do one more bite. Asuka. Yeah, when I first, like, installed the PS remote app I was like okay this is this is real easy no problem and then when, when I like was was playing and I couldn't like literally use the controllers on my Legion Go I was like what in the world is this I thought I was doing something wrong I was looking at all the options but it wasn't it wasn't the console is just, just the way that Sony does the handshake for controllers to work using their official remote app Okay, no back foot there. Oh, it's gonna try the RKO. Uh, not today. All right, let's set you up for a. Oh, ooh. Let's do the giant swing. That should do it. If not, let's do the. There you go. I call that the home run. Okay, so there you have it. That's the. Lenovo Legion Go on how to set up Chiaki um, for your remote uh, play for PS5 using a handheld device, whether this is the Legion Go or the Ally X. All right, so if you found this video valuable, please go ahead and hit that like button. Uh, also comment if you're using this already. And if it's your first time coming to the channel, please consider hitting that subscribe button. It really helps the channel grow. With that said, uh, happy gaming. Take care of yourself and each other, and we will catch you on the next video. Bye for now.